Well, YouTube, my name is Renaud, and right now I'm going to make a short video on how to get the 3.0 firmware on your iPod Touch for free, and you don't have to pay any cost for this, and let's get started. And first of all, what you want to do is to put your iPod into the DFU mode. There's my iPod right there. Okay. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna put this into a DFU mode. To do that, I'm first gonna need to plug this into my computer. Alright. Well, it's gonna be kinda hard for me. I'm using one hand for the camera. So I'm gonna put it down. Hold up. Just a second, guys. Try to plug this in. Okay. And now you want to plug the other end to your iPod. Just like that. And it's going to turn on. It's going to say battery sync, whatever. Well, it's not right now. Make sure it says that. I don't know why isn't it reading it. I can shoot all my pop up for me, but I don't know why it's in it reading. There you go. Okay, you wanna slide to one lot. Blah blah blah. Okay, there you go. And now what you wanna do is to set this into DFU mode and to hold down the power and the home button for ten seconds. Alright. Actually, watch out. Power and the home button for. It's hard for me to do this because I'm holding the camera with one hand. I hope I can set the camera somewhere, but I can't. So just hold them down for 10 seconds. Oh my goodness. There. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Oops, no, my. I can let go of the power button. Well, you know what? Let's do it this way. Turn off your iPod. Okay, turn it all the way off. And there's two ways to do it. Okay, you can also start it off there. You can also start it off here. Turn it off all the way. Okay, now it's all off. Now hold the power and the home button for 10 seconds. Okay, so I'm going to put the camera down. Kind of actually... Alright. Oh, crap. There. I hope you guys can see me. Let me see. Oops, my bad. The camera just fell. Okay. Again. Oh, come on, this you gotta be kidding me. Okay, never mind, I'll just do it like this. Uh just hold the power and the home button for ten seconds. Okay. There whoa. So ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Now let go of the power button. Keep on holding down to the home button. Okay. Until you hear the beep on your computer. Okay. And keep holding down to the power button. I mean the home button. There you go. Okay, now on your computer you'll see iTunes thing. iTunes will say there's an iPod into recovery mode. Your iPod should not turn on. See, right there. Your iPod should not turn on at all. No lights at all. And what I did was hold down the power and the home button for 10 seconds. Then let go of the power button. Keep, keep on holding down to the home button until your computer reads it. Alright. 
And I'll set your iPod aside right there. Now, on iTunes, click OK. Now, what you want to do is you have to download the firmware, the 3.0 firmware. Do not download the beta firmware, okay? Um, there's a couple of types of firmware for the 3.0. There's betas and all that. Don't get the beta. Get the full version. So, once you're done doing that, go go ahead and see if you, okay, I already have the folder, I mean the firmware downloaded. So go on to restore. Do not click on it. So you first hold down shift on your keyboard right there. Shift, hold it down, and then click on left click on restore. Then something like that should pop up your folder. And you want to locate the firmware wherever you saved it at. I saved it on my documents. Right there, documents. Then I'll have to go on to iPod Touch firmware, which was where I saved it at, which is right here. If you guys can see it. Oops right there click on it and then there it is and double click on the firmware and it will start restoring it to the 3.0 firmware make sure your iPod doesn't turn on yet okay so thanks for watching and please subscribe rate comment and yeah and leave some video responses on the bottom alright Thanks for watching.